the tapestry of ancient history in Southern Africa. Southern Africa's ancient history is a captivating tapestry woven with diverse cultures, civilizations, and peoples, reflecting a deep-rooted human presence that spans thousands of years. This historical journey takes us through the annals of time, providing glimpses into the rich and intricate fabric of the region's past. One of the region's remarkable civilizations is the Kingdom of Mapungubwe, which ascended to prominence between the 9th and 13th centuries. Nestled in what is now South Africa, Mapungubwe flourished as a thriving trade hub characterized by its sophisticated social structure. The kingdom engaged in trade with distant lands like India and China, and its artisans, crafted intricate gold artifacts, showcasing their exceptional craftsmanship and artistic prowess. This period marked a significant chapter in Southern Africa's ancient history. Another iconic civilization is the great Zimbabwe Empire, an ancient kingdom that thrived from the 11th to the 15th centuries. Located in present-day Zimbabwe, Great Zimbabwe stood as a symbol of wealth and power. It was a flourishing center of trade and commerce, bearing testimony to the region's advanced society with extensive trade networks. The enigmatic stone ruins of Great Zimbabwe are now a UNESCO World Heritage Site, preserving this ancient legacy for future generations. The tapestry of Southern Africa's ancient history extends to its diverse ethnic groups, each contributing to the region's cultural mosaic. The San people, revered as the indigenous inhabitants of the region. The San people, also known as Bushmen, have a history dating back over 20,000 years. They were skilled hunter-gatherers who lived in small nomadic groups. Their profound understanding of the environment is etched in rock art, portraying their daily lives, spiritual beliefs, and their connection to nature. These rock art sites are scattered throughout the region and serve as invaluable windows into their way of life. The Zulu people, the Amazulu, the largest ethnic group in South Africa, are celebrated for their vibrant cultural traditions, encompassing music, dance, and art. Led by illustrious figures such as King Shaka Zulu, the Zulu kingdom has left an indelible mark on the region's history. The Xhosa people, Primarily residing in South Africa's Eastern Cape province, the Xhosa people are known for their unique language, characterized by click consonants. They also have distinctive traditional clothing and initiation rituals, including the notable male initiation ceremony known as Ulwaluko, the Sotho people. Also referred to as Basotho, they are a prominent ethnic group in both Lesotho and South Africa. Their artistic skills shine through pottery, beadwork, and weaving. The Sotho's rich oral tradition includes storytelling and proverbs. The Twana people. Known as Botswana, they constitute the largest ethnic group in Botswana. Their way of life revolves around cattle farming and agriculture, and their cultural heritage is punctuated by music and dance, with the traditional Setapa dance being a standout. The Ndebele people. Found in South Africa, Zimbabwe and Botswana, the Ndebele people are renowned for their intricate beadwork and colorful geometric art, known as Ndebele art. They also have distinct traditional attire. The Swazi people. Emaswati, the primary ethnic group in Eswatini, hold deep-rooted traditions and customs, including the annual Inkwala ceremony which celebrates kingship and the kingdom's renewal. Around two millennia ago, the arrival of Bantu-speaking peoples marked a significant milestone in the region's history. Their expertise in agriculture and ironworking led to settled communities and the emergence of complex societies. This Bantu expansion played a pivotal role in shaping Southern Africa's cultural and linguistic diversity. Between the 9th and 14th centuries, a tapestry of African kingdoms and trading states flourished in southern Africa. Notably, the enigmatic Great Zimbabwe Kingdom, with its opulent legacy and the thriving trade networks of the time, provide a testament to the region's historical significance. 
the arrival of Portuguese explorers led by Bartolomeo Dias in 1488 marked the inception of European exploration and colonization in southern Africa. Over the subsequent centuries, Dutch, British and other European powers established trading posts and colonies along the coastline, setting in motion a complex era of colonialism. The 19th century witnessed the scramble for Africa, reshaping the region through colonization. The British Empire gained control over significant portions of southern Africa, giving rise to colonies like the Cape Colony, now South Africa, and Rhodesia, now Zimbabwe. This period saw the exploitation of the region's abundant resources, resulting in the displacement of indigenous populations and the oppression of non-white communities.